Hello paintball world, this is Jeff at Action Center Paintball, actioncenterpaintball.com. We're going to unbox the BT TM15 today, show you uh, the limited edition E-Tax, show you uh, all about it. Uh, this will be on our site. Uh, we won't do an individual video for every different color. The only differences in the different limited edition is their colors. They all have the same features. Uh, personally, I've used this E-Tax. They work really well. Uh, one of my favorites. Uh, in fact, uh, it's second in line uh, only to my autococker. That should tell you something if you know me. Welcome today. Uh, let's take a look at this uh, box. comes in a nice big box. That's one thing we like and don't like. We don't like big shipping boxes, but that's how it comes. In a nice big box. Foam inserts on it. First thing we take a look at here is your barrel instructions. So you had to curve the ball or a bit raise the ball. Works on the Bernoulli principle, the apex too, and so you can do that if you like that particular thing. Also the owner's manual here, full color owner's manual, shows you what you need to do to make that gun work the way it should work. Okay, always read your manual, makes your job, my job, a lot better. Okay, let's pull this foam off and show you what's inside. Okay, ETAC paintball gun, of course you have the nice foam insert. Uh, so the gun don't get hurt and it works really well. I'm going to pull around here so that I can pull this off one by one. First thing we notice, of course, we love on the on the Empire and the BT paintball guns is their parts kit. Comes with Allen wrenches, uh, poppet seals, grease, which is always a good thing. Um, you got springs, O-rings, uh, even even some screws and a battery. Uh, with this particular one, so they got a nice full uh, parts kit with this gun. Barrel sleeve, okay, Empire barrel sleeve in e tax color. Here's the gun itself. The features on it, of course, you've got no lines, which is great for all guns. We like that. Um, your Select switch right here, on off switch right here. We like that point when you turn it on, you can see a nice light emitting diode right here. It tells you what's going on with your gun. You have a stock, four position stock that fits your every need, whatever size you are. You've got the clamping feed neck right here. Uh, one of the things we like about it is this isn't a permanent thing. You can push this little button right here, slide it forward into the slot, pull it off, clean it out, do whatever you need to do that way. Also, on the front here, you've got a, a movable front grip, okay, that can adjust your any way you wish. Right here we have the front and rear sights, lift up sights. I don't use huge sights, but I do like scopes myself, but you may like them. That's what they're there for. Uh, you also have multiple weaver rails on this gun, on the top, on the two sides, and underneath. Fits, you can fit lasers, flashlights. Uh, any tactical gear that you wish to have on it. One of the things that I like about this particular gun is the battery. A lot of times with most guns uh, they have the battery inside the grip uh, but with this gun you just push the release here slide your clip out. You'll see on here you'll see a plus and a minus sign. You put your battery in in there you can see where it fits but you don't have to look at that because you got them nice light signs right there. You just put your battery in boom you're ready to go. Quick, easy, fast. We like that in a paintball gun. Okay. Underneath that gun is you, you've got your apex barrel. This is an auto cocker thread. Slide it in here. Screw it on. And boom. You're ready to go. You turn this any way you want to, re, to, uh, to adjust the ball. This is the adjustment right on the top. You notice that it puts a spin on the ball in here. Personally, I'm not an Apex fan. I'm not a flat line kind of guy. I like a little more accuracy and a little more quiet. That's one of the, another thing that I like about this particular marker is it's got plenty of room for any type of barrel. It takes auto cocker threads. Personally, this is one barrel that I like, a 20 inch barrel. I know that around the paint bar world they say that size doesn't matter, but at Action Center, I like it. It's nice to have a barrel that's good and long. It makes it quiet. For sure, it makes a difference in the quiet. Uh, personally, that's how I would set up this marker. 
it's an excellent choice right now. Uh, these are on sale, um, and so is the the uh, the rip drive that goes with that gun. This is an autococker threaded barrel, so it'll fit almost any barrel. This is the BTT M15. You can find it at ActionCenterPaintball.com, UtahPaintballSupply.com, and PaintballGuns.tv. We'll see you in the middle.